What are we making today, son? I don't know, do I? Yes, you do. We're making we'll make a pine tart. Pine tart. And, and your favorite macaroni and cheese. Pine tart. Macaroni and cheese. And macaroni and cheese. Leave like and subscribe. Also share. Follow the like and subscribe. Also, please follow. Mind your language, please, son. Auntie Dolly's on. Say something to her. Hello, Auntie Dolly. That's it. Run your the iPad quickly, please. Tyler Perry. You done it? So to make pine tart, apparently you need pineapple. <laughs> I wouldn't have guessed. How do you know if a pineapple is ripe? They say, if you can do that. <laughs> really? Yes. That's what they say. Fire. Yep. Whoa! And where's the flower? <laughs> come out the way, My son. name is Mr. Pineapple. Okay, me and my flower. Can you come out the pineapple? Let me find the rest of the stuff. Tina said you're cute, son. Isaiah? Uh -huh. Tina said you're cute. Yeah. Auntie Dolly said save some for her. Don't worry, doll, you'll get some tomorrow. That's what I was about to say. <laughs> what did you say then? Careful, these are sharp ends. Um, Don't do that. Sorry, does this tool have to be in the way? Sorry. <coughs> Thank you. Ooh, it's nice. Thank you. It smells very nice. 
Bobs, you can't cut this. It's hard. It's hard to cut. cut. Um, I still can't find my measuring cup. What can I do? It's in there. Where? Uh, okay. In the box. Not good to eat. Anybody want to make drink with a skin? Me. I'm it. It's gonna eat your tongue. The only guy in these people may see washed pineapple with salt. It works though. I don't see anybody else does it. I told two people that the other day someday this week we're talking about pineapple and they said how much they love it but it itches their mouth all the time so i told them to wash it with salt get a small pot from in there small pot from in there Turn off the camera over. This? The other one, yeah, the other one, the big size one. I'm just cutting up my pineapple. Mmm! As small as I can. So that it cooks quick. Thought you're blending it. I was. Should I? Yeah. Place mm -hmm. a piece. Because we'll boil quicker. Mm. It's like sugar. Mm. In the sun. Oh, we could do that. I need to make, get ice to make ice water to do the thing. Some of these big heads in the way. When did you put that? Mine. And you put in the camera out of the way. So. You need to go the camera please. Hey, you know. <laughs> so I can have one piece. I haven't. So I, uh, I haven't had any. We so are meant to be using that to cook. Normally, you guys don't eat pineapple. What about today? You go both gonna be evicted out of the kitchen. Hmm? You're gonna be evicted out of the kitchen if you keep behaving like that. Anybody ever try making pine um uh, pine tart before? Please give me ideas how to make this crust because I don't really know what I'm doing. Yeah, we never know what we're doing. <laughs> it's like a typical thing. Yeah, but this this pineapple is juicy, man. You see how yellow it is. <clears throat> so said rather than just leaving it like that if you put it in a blender um, thingy if you have a blender put it in and blend it up that way It's gonna be cooked quicker and it's gonna be nice apparently. Mm -hmm. Wait, we're making pineapple juice? No, we're making. Mind it. Yeah.
it's not sitting properly. Ready? Yeah! I told you it's not in properly. I think I just broke it. Yep, I can see that too. Yeah, we can Hmm? We just did. That's it. It's in now. Oh, that's giving me juice though. Yes, but it boils down. Oh, okay. You don't do it too much, you just do it together. Put some sugar in it. It's the iPad. I can drink it like that. I have a right there. Next to the iPad. Next to the iPad. Hold it. Mm -hmm. Use the finger and lick it like this. Mm. It's because he's repeating the same thing. <laughs> Look what they're doing. They're meant to be helping. So, so in your um, blended pineapple, notice it still has grain in it. It's not too smooth. So you're gonna put in some mixed spice. Mixed spice. Where is the cinnamon going? Behind. Pasta. No, bottom. Behind, straight down there. You just touch it. Cinnamon, I like spice and nutmeg. Cinnamon. Mm, yes, enough. Mm. I think that's it. Spice got all the things that inside is it? And sugar. And then you put your sugar. How much sugar we put in? A lot. How sweet do you want it? I want to break 10 times. 10 times. Times. Can I stir it? Come back here. Can I stir it? No, me too. No. I can't let it out. Yeah, so how much sugar should we put? A lot. Tell us. Someone said. Yeah, um, Vicky, you can use a. Um, yeah, you can use a jam if you don't have. Um, Someone said, is my rear there too? Yes, she is. Yes. Yes, she is. Just one hand. Just one Four spoons of sugar. Oh, well, that's not enough. So much? Yeah. Mm. We want it to Stop be it. nice and sweet. Not a lot of sugar. I want to get to look for my dad. You so come and simmer that slowly over there. Right? So you're going to put it on low fire. Or you're going to keep turning it. Put that spoon in the sink. Use another one. The wooden one. So let's clear up this mess that I didn't make. Yes, you did. Do you want pineapple drink with it? Yeah. What's up, pineapple drink with this? You want it to use? No, put it. Nothing there. So, um, guy, in this thing, you put your the pineapple skin in a uh, mug or a pot. Uh -huh. Some people buy it. But I don't buy I don't like on a spice. Why did I do that? <laughs> I don't like it. I'm not It's the skin! It's the skin! This is something you can always remember, son, because when you drink this juice, mm -hmm. you're gonna like it. 
Can you put the pot on the fire properly? Yeah, up on the top. Mind the oil and stuff moving over. So that's a skin and lip mug. That's the skin. And then you fill it up with good water, good drinking water. That, by tomorrow, that's gonna be nice pineapple infused water. So you take it, put some sugar inside. Mm -hmm. There you have it, juice. Yeah. Pineapple juice. My hand is so sticky, how sweet that thing is. That pineapple. Pick up, pick up, pick up, pick up, pick up. Sabrina, what do you add in the crust? What, what do you put with the flour? You put everything in and mix up now. <laughs> ben, so we put everything in and mix up. I thought you know how to make this thing. I've never made pastry crust from scratch. I usually buy ready-made pastry. Wow. Well, that's a real help. Anyway, put your macaroni to boil. <laughs> for your macaroni cheese. So do I don't think it has for us. This man about pasta with cold water over there. Why don't you soak in a soil as well? It's just a stick. No. <laughs> She's still contemplating what to do with the flour. <laughs> this might be another disaster. Cup flour. <laughs> Two cup flour. Three cup flour. <laughs> so, Ben, the pastry is becoming darker. Low heat. Um, I need a knife to chop this water up into squares. You make me lose view. I lowered the fire. Me knife dinner. Are you a frog son? Why are you making that sound? Have a piece of cheese. It's yo, butter. Yo. You can't leave this. Well, but I have some. Nope. What? It's butter, it's not cheese. Hey. I 
I don't know if this is right. I'm supposed to be trying to cut this butter into cubes because I can't remember if you're supposed to mix it in. I need a cold water over there, yeah? So when the butter is chilled, it's not melted or anything. Are you supposed to put oil in it as well? <laughs> Can you just follow the recipe? We don't really get shortening, well, unless we get it in a different name here. I don't know what shortening is. Well, I, a shortening is frozen vegetable fat. Today is Saturday, so you're now waking up, eh? Saturday is housework day, cook day. Probably have to jump to that. That's if it's not enough, check. You might need more. Place for mixable, add salt, add. Sugar. Give me salt there, yeah. Sift together. I'm trying to break the butter up. I think I'm doing it right. Add butter and shorten it. We can't have the fire. No. No, I don't. How much salt? Salt the taste? <laughs> yeah. Just go with it. How much sugar? Put the sugar. Let's go with it. Two tablespoons of sugar. It will also make it flaky as well. Huh? It also make it flaky as well. What? Crumble with your fingers. No oil. Do you the pineapple's gonna be enough? <laughs> Somebody should take off your gold bar. <laughs> These gold bars don't really come off my hands, girl. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Man. <laughs> Man. Yeah, what do you need to get thick? So you just stay there and turn. Why is it grandpa? You put my pineapple pieces in there. It's too far away from me. Do we put oil, chilled oil or not? No, no oil. Okay. But the short thing is oil. Okay. Well, let's find out what happens now. You know, supposed to make it like pea size with the butter. Well, it is crumbled up. Somebody else makes this. Sort of Form into a lock, place on a plastic. Wrap. Roll it into a foot line. Wrap it in plastic with a refrigerator. So you need one egg white. Egg white is for brushing. I 
Are you actually doing it properly? Well, it's a knead into a dough, and don't be afraid to give it a good knead because. Don't play the flower too much. The heat will melt it. <laughs> My, the way my mother said it's bad. <laughs> Why? Yeah, it's picking up now. Stay there. Why are you so angry? You're still trying to get a cling fit? Mm -hmm. <laughs> It's supposed to be crumbly. Well, it looks crumbly there. Yeah. Squeeze it to make a log, a line, lantern post. Okay. Don't need it too much. They think shrink it. The base is literally shrink it. So how you meant to get that into more longer? It's supposed to be longer. This should be okay. We can cut it into pieces to roll. That's why you, that's why we did roll it into a log. I don't know if it's crumbly enough or if it's holding enough. Well, I'll put it in the fridge for a bit. Put a bottom. Put on a bottom and take it all back there, so. Because it can't get four hours. So they say four hours in the fridge, but we don't have four hours. So it's going in the freezer. Alright, let's check out the sauce. That's been making. See? It's dark Pineapple and brown sugar. Nicely. Come on, Fungo. And that's just gonna simmer there. We need to work on the cheese for the um, macaroni. If we could have go buy this thing at shop, we'd have done that and buy more. Right? I said, look, we made it. <laughs> but there's no shop over here to sell this thing anyway that I know, that I know of. And this is one of my favorite things to eat, especially in the morning. <laughs> Breakfast. Work on the cheese there now, please. What do I do with the cheese? Grate it in the, in the processor. Now. So we got um, macaroni boiling there. So we're gonna do the cheese now. What do I do with this cheese? Grate it? Yeah. Not grate it. Set the food processor out. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Just lay this on top where the plates are. So we're using 
British mature cheddar. 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 And this one is Leicester. Red Leicester. Smells good. Like cheese. Yes, Sabrina. Homemade is always better. And so Going back to the faithful food processor. Faithful food processor. Again. I'm gonna show you an easy way to do this again. Give it a Where is that a bit? smallest one of these see bacon is not really my thing give me a curry or a rice Any guy needs food to make, like proper food. I'll make it. So take your cheese, spin. like uh, cheese. <laughs> Me dry feet, mouse cheese are right, and then run away. <laughs> so look at this. Nice and fine. So you can sprinkle everywhere. Luden, you made me laugh. He said, when people ask me why I don't know how to cook, <laughs> this thing look hard to do. 
Luden, as long as you can light a fire, trust me, you can figure the rest out. It's not that hard. Easy to Conquer the fear, come on, and try it. And that's the cheese done great. If you had to grate that by hand, you'd still be doing it. Finish. Sure, it's gonna do a three. I don't know. This looks finished here. But do you think we should get it a bit more dry? Hello, Oma. Oma, do you think we should make it a bit drier? I'll chuck it back on for a few minutes. Still boiling away. Okay, pasta ready to strain. We're making pine tart and macaroni and cheese. Have some color? That is the color. Okay. Yeah, you gotta cool down now. I think we have to put it outside in the cold to cool down quickly. <laughs> mm, it tastes just like pine, um, pine tart thing inside. Because it's still cold outside, we're going to take advantage of the winter months, eh? Hope no one the pot and care, mate. Hope the cat don't try to eat it. I'm gonna make the. Every time I make macaroni pie, I make it differently. Really? <laughs> yeah. So, so what are you doing? So that's some milk I'm gonna put in there. Who's who, who's good at making macaroni and cheese? Everybody. Tell me quick. Everybody makes it differently. I'm making it the English way, I think. So I'm using mustard. Using what? Mustard. Mustard. We're going to get this open now. I'll use a knife now. You buy the mic, you know? You buy the mic, I'm around with you, bye. Corn starts sticking in the top. Oh, this is dried mustard. That's interesting. I've never seen dried mustard before. Mustard. But you bought it. Yeah, I thought it was just a small container of mustard. <laughs> oh well, that's gonna have to work. You should only use a machine for the day carrots. You know. Carrots? Give a nice look. Ground black pepper, eggs. So you put in milk for by the way, or I need some butter in there. Throw that in there. Here's the butter going in. How will you put some, some rum? Black pepper. Rum. <laughs> Where's the black pepper though? Right there. 
Why are you dismantling my cupboard? Your yeah, cupboard is looking very tidy, love. So why are you making a thing? Do anybody ever put eggs in, the, no. in this space? I've never put eggs. Why you want to do it now? I don't know because I know some people do. Fry butter, then add flour and milk, then mustard, salt, pepper, and then cheese. Vicky. And I've never actually put flour in either. Actually, yes, I did use one type of chicken the sauce. A bit of flowers going in. That's why I stick to um, traditional food. <laughs> <laughs> and a drop of this powdered mustard. I normally use. Give me a cook up rice. A cook I'll let man. you guys know how this powdered mustard works. Bring the cheese. Yeah. Bring the cheese. Am I working with you? Yeah. Sorry. Otherwise, I quit. So the reason I want macaroni and cheese to eat is because you have leftover barbecue. Yes. <laughs> that barbecue went on a treat. I'm just dissolving the cheese. Safia says she used one egg to hold it for. I'm a bit reluctant to put egg. Well, it's too late now, anyway. <laughs> Alright, that is a lot of cheese. Might need a bit more milk. You sure you know it? Well, this is how I always do it. Okay, okay. And it usually tastes quite nice. This looks nice and smooth here. Black pepper. I put salt. That's why I'm going to taste it. Tastes like cheese sauce. In there, that can't use it, I guess. Don't know which tray hey, that one for the point out. <laughs> yes, boss. <laughs> I will do whatever you say for today. But well, if you want to eat, you better do it. What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> That's me. Can you hear you threatening me here? Bearing in mind, making macaroni and cheese wasn't part of the plan. What's that supposed to mean? Huh? <laughs> I was in the supermarket when this Mr. Man called me and said, Oh, buy macaroni. Are we going to fit in the other pan? No. Yes. We're going to bake the pan the pastries on the flat tray. Let there be macaroni and cheese. <laughs> Doesn't look right. Does anybody put carrot inside? Shredded carrot. Carrots. I know a few guys people who do that nowadays. I do. Do you? I never made it, but I do. <laughs> That's what I would do. Oh, if you put some parsley in there and some coriander on top. <laughs> and it wouldn't be a cheese. I 
don't know why, but I always feel the need to give this a mix back. Yeah. Why? I don't know. I just like to do it. Yes, Vicky. Let's put some curry under there. <laughs> Vicky, this man is crazy. Don't encourage him. Odetta Norris Duncan is on. Odetta, what up, girl? She's trying to make <laughs> macaroni and cheese. Well, I don't know if she's trying, but yeah. So basically, the top is gonna become very cheesy. Oh, that I put sweet peppers. Yes, the Trinidadians do. Everybody has different ways of doing this thing. Literally, it's just macaroni and cheese. What you choose to put in between it is completely up your. Is the fire on in the back there? Whoops, yep. Just pour the whole thing and level it off. Hot dogs chopped up. Mix in. That's that interesting. interesting. <laughs> I would do that. I suppose that's one way to get more things. Maybe put chicken all in there. <laughs> <laughs> sweet corn, yeah. Yeah, I know people put sweet corn and peppers. That's what I've heard about. How about if you layer it with, with some nice ham now? <laughs> then it becomes an actual pie. Anyhow, this is going into the oven. Tomato and onion slices. Interesting. Yeah, I've seen somebody made it for a work do with tomatoes. And I Did you even light up the oven before? Yeah. Okay. I didn't like the onion, the tomatoes on it. Okay, go on. Stick it in the oven. How long you put it in for? Um, when it looks done. <laughs> Trays a bit too high. Okay, that's on one eighty. So that's with my barbecue this afternoon for dinner. Yeah, man. <laughs> Okay. So are we going back to the pine tart? Pine tart now. The main star of the show. Star of the show. <laughs> Probably not gonna be a star, but who knows? Where is it? Huh? It's in here. It's in the freezer. It feels a bit flaky. Poke, poke. And it's cold. Okay. This kitchen being very hot is probably not going to help. Take that around over there, hold it. And lay it with um, Bring out the big guns. Really? <laughs> yeah, the rolling pin. Oh, um. are you not working today? I don't want to do the washing up anymore. <laughs> <coughs> I just cough. I think I have corona. Guys, I think he have corona. Corona bear. I don't know if this is gonna work. Might be doing it wrong. You meant to roll it smaller. Well, I'm trying to cut it smaller.
<laughs> so you cut them and then what do you do? Well, I'm cutting them like this so then we can roll them into the circles to fold them. She's off still in bed. Are we, yeah. So where when I'm done here I'll call you. We'll bring you some of this. <laughs> <coughs> So I want to try and roll one out because I don't know if it's going to work. This is going to work. We got need. We can do anything. <laughs> and there's still quite a lot of pasta pieces in between it. Eh? I'm so ready to eat this thing. Can you go bring the pineapple? <laughs> you guys who are joining us and watching, I think you guys, I in Guyanese, they say I like little chopinis. It's fun watching other people, isn't it? <laughs> Even if we make a fool of ourselves. Is it cold? You know how to pull it? Yeah. I want to see them like nice triangle. Two, one and a half, I think. Yeah, but one is not enough. Well, I'm going by the size of the thing and just turning it out. <coughs> Oh, you don't want um, fried chicken? Um, the chicken. Okay. Oh, she's vegetarian. She's vegetarian. Oh, oh, yeah. I think this is how it's supposed to be done. So, wait, how are you supposed to seal it? That's it sealed, and then you brush it with the egg white. Yeah, but it's gonna open back. Well, it's gonna leak a little bit somewhere. <coughs> are you not flooring this? I should, shouldn't I? Otherwise, it'll come out back. So we have the tray there. I think I've done it a bit too small, so that's one my one. That's my one. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> well, you actually brush the egg white to seal it, or you put the egg white? Um... You brush the egg white to seal it, don't you? Come and get get the egg white out. Kind of belly in that. I don't know. It's the butter. The butter is sticking. <laughs> the bowl has got the egg. We you already burst it? No, I haven't burst it yet. I feel like if I keep putting so much, it... Um, that didn't go as planned. <laughs> well, separate the yellow, scoop it out with a spoon. It bars. Oh, okay. Yeah, you can sort. Okay, get another one. Put a little hole on the egg. Big man like me can bust one egg. <laughs> okay, this is real tricky. So Onika said you're doing wrong. Onika, what is wrong? Tell me, tell me, tell me. <laughs> Vicky says stop making a laugh. Fool me? And again. 
I told you to put a little hole in the egg. I did put a little hole, but the hole it was. <laughs> okay, that can work with a little bit there. Yeah. The egg is obedient. So, what I think you should do is use the egg. Take a spoon and take out the middle, yellow bit now. So full of this business. Happy? It says egg white, not white with a drop of yellow. <laughs> At what point do we poke it with the forks? Remember guys, it's a trial, we're not making this thing to sell, we're making this thing to eat. <laughs> Andrea, what do you mean, what are we doing? We're trying to bake pine tarts. <laughs> if you're Guyanese, you know, it's basically a pastry with pineapple jam inside. Bear in mind, I said we're trying, alright? Yeah, we did roll out together and cut it. Look, that's what left of the roll there. Yeah, I did slice them, but I think they were a bit too small. We had it in a roll. Some are being made bigger than some. Ah, the big one, never me one. Just want to um, place my order from Orly. For those of who you live in Guyana or live in New York and have the luxury of bakeries around you, you're very blessed. And so put more jam inside. I told you not put enough I'm jam. I'm trying to save the jam. <laughs> you meant to put water there to seal it up, sir. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay, let's try that. Market. Oh, okay. Huh? Take the fork and mark it before you. Yeah, you meant to put holes in it. See, this is why we're doing this video, <laughs> so people can help out each other. <laughs> <laughs> so how, how do you mark it? You just put holes in it. No, like I see they do it like that. Why? You never remember Auntie Nita Pine Tart used to have park holes in it. I think it's to create air pockets. Blood. So that when it's sealed, it doesn't run out. That's my understanding of it. Where's your phone? I'm afraid to put too much jam inside in case when it starts to bake, it'll start seeping out. It everywhere. wouldn't seep out, it's dry enough. That's what they're saying. You, you can't try to save the thing. You want to save them for, for, for make more? Well, we have a lot of dough. Don't save it. Oh, the water, where the water then? if it's gonna work we're going by your recommendation who recommend the water to see it I can't remember doesn't it work though I don't know Probably shouldn't be doing this, but okay. Oh so, well. Babe. Huh? 
Mm. The thicker, if you want the thicker um, thing, a uh, crust, yeah. you take them six inches long, bigger. <clears throat> so the more the flatter you do, the more crust you get. More. Well, well, the bigger you get, the less crust because you're making the dough stretch. Brush the edges with white, egg white. Oh, egg white before you seal or before what? Before you put the jam on it. You understand? Yeah, with so egg white. The holes, yeah. Okay. Let me say. Let's say brush it before you pierce it, but. Um. Well, at some point you gotta pierce. So I brush the egg with egg white, the edge with egg white. The, the, the pastry look feels nice though. Well, one thing I noticed the pastry still has clumps of butter inside. This one's gonna seep out. You didn't put it back over. Um, how is it meant to be yellow? You know, so I was put coloring on it. Oh yeah. How does it go yellow by itself? I, does the egg make it yellow? I think you put some kind of coloring in the egg wash, maybe. Hmm? Maybe some coloring in the egg wash. <laughs> you <laughs> ask me. <laughs> Guys, have a laugh at our expense, please. They're already laughing at me <laughs> If you don't laugh, you're gonna cry. But them look nice though. Don't worry, by tomorrow I'll let them eat out already. <laughs> whether they square or they leak or whatever, give me the egg wash. Grab that thing from me, why? Oh, um. If you have extra dough, make cheese roll. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. You used all the cheese already, didn't you? Yeah. How do you even make cheese roll? So you flavor the cheese, I guess? Yeah. Pepper. You know, Diane should have been on here and tell us about it. Yeah, Diana, where are you? Wake up. Tyler, call the mother and wake her up. I can see how this brush is sealing it. Wait, you need to pack them a bit nicer than that so they can fit. Man, girl, you pack now. We can't move them, we done thing. Okay, don't trouble them, leave them. We can use another tray. Why are you throwing so much egg white on the tray for? I didn't mean to, it happened by accident. <laughs> Woke up this morning, brush my teeth. And thought about Can you buying dart. Put on some um, soca. To fill my teeth. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> <clears throat> so now she's trying them ones with the sealing the end with the egg. We only have white cheese in there, only cheddar cheese. Let's see if it's still a one. Everybody coming up with different, different things. It says I'll use the whole egg. <laughs> I tell you something, one thing I need a good at is having multiple versions of doing the same thing. So cheese roll. Cheese, pepper, mustard, and a little seasoning. Great the cheese, let me get it. What cheese? A little bit of white cheese is there. <coughs> Wait, all the thing done already? But me want more pine tart, you got care pine tart for tomorrow. Only enough pine tart for um only oh, enough this cheese. Huh? No, that's paneer, not that. Oh. <laughs> you make people laugh me. Oh I use flat cheese and rub wrap up in them. <laughs> we don't have a lot, so just and great half of that cheese there.
Let's stretch this one out more. That's the best way to make the last one. Look. You look fat. Yeah, you look fat and swell up. Make you even mind me on that one. Happy, happy, happy. Alright, so how do you make cheese roll again? Anybody knows? So I'm guessing you flavor the cheese and then you fill. You wrap it the same way, you, you roll it however. However, you mentioned how you roll it. <laughs> Alright, so that's the cheese there. Put some pepper sauce. Really? Yeah, it's cheese roll, a drop of pepper sauce. Some black <laughs> pepper. If you have strawberries, it makes strawberry tart. I thought about that. Nah, you can't eat pineapple, man. <coughs> Where is the thing? Pepper sauce. Oh. But it's in too hot. Yeah, put a little bit. This, yeah, make nobody can eat the thing. A drop, you put in a drop. So the tray and I get space for the last one. There you go. Devil's eye. <laughs> that looks like a drop? Yeah. This pepper is deadly. I don't laugh for us, we frighten pepper. So I need to make space. Wait, the one's not going to coat yet. Yeah, no, I'm trying to make space for this last one. One last one. Oh. Put it in the other tray and you still got to get things for that. Okay. Clever, 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 clever Batman. You're for Mike, huh? Okay, move that one out of the way. So how do you make this? How do you roll the pastry for the cheese roll? How do you scale up yourself cook? <laughs> Listen, at least we're not afraid to try. Me shame for all Tommy. How do you get this cheese seasoning? Okay, let me get some garlic, some black pepper. I find some leftover yellow cheese. Hi. Okay, can we put them in now? I guess so. Put them in now. <coughs> okay, finish it. We put them on all, all together. No, put them in, put them in. No! Put them in! Actually, I'm just bringing up a vague memory of making cheese, mashing cheese like this. You sure it was cheese or a mango? No, it was cheese at Wake House somewhere to make cheese roll, but I wasn't really involved in the actual making. Roshani is on. Roshani, what up, girl? Oh, Roshani. Okay. <laughs> mustard. Oh, mustard. mustard. That's it. See, everybody on this thing I help out today. <laughs> so it doesn't fall into N, I think. Is it meant to be crusty like this? 
Okay. Roll out the dough, brush the edge with the egg, egg white, add the cheese mixture at the end, and roll it. And then you press it. Roll it. As in, they lay it out. Yeah. Roll it round. They lay it out. Do you bake it into a circle? Okay, don't put more flour. Why don't you just make a big roti with cheese inside and done? <laughs> <laughs> Roche Nisa she's here. We're trying to make pine tart and since we got a little dough left, somebody suggested we make cheese roll. I think you guys enjoy watching us suffer suffer here today. <laughs> <laughs> now what do I do? She said, um, do this to the end. Pizza. <laughs> yeah, just like it looks like a pizza, doesn't it? Oh, no, it's no pizza. But it's supposed to be individual. When you're done, then you cut it. How? And then you press this. Just put the thing inside there. So we're just crumbling this in. Yeah, and then you roll it. It's a cheese roll. Yeah, it's a pastry roll. It's not a roll like a swirl, is it? Diana, where are you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, not so big. <laughs> <laughs> Too late. <laughs> Um, how about you make oh, a spin? Oh, swirly, swirly, swirly. Wait, let me just look up the thing. Wait. Quick, go on Google. You can't lose with Google, can you? Well, I don't have too much laughing today. You guys are using your Saturday morning. And afternoon, as it's four o'clock in the afternoon already, the watchers lose tripping us. But if we inspire you guys to try, well, wouldn't have been so bad after all. Try if we get Alice's headache. Oh, okay, look. Go back. Yeah, that was a pastry. Go back. Pinterest has come to the rescue. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. I think I get it now. Yeah, that's why it's gonna roll. Okay. Oh, this is the recipe for the pine tart roll, by the way. That's pe pepper, there. pepper there. Oh my lord. Okay, so you roll it. Go back. Up. Hold on, hold on. Okay, and okay. So she did it individually. Okay, so we're gonna cheat because it's too late. It has to be a little wet. Though. So much roll I got? Well, yeah. Are you making one big one? <laughs> <laughs> that is one giant cheese roll. <laughs> <laughs> Oh well. Oh well. You live and you learn. How about you cut there and just make it in two? You could have been cut it and make it smaller anyway. But if I cut it there, the cheese is the filling is in the middle. It you just press seep. it to the far. It might seep out. We will share this one. <laughs> we will share it half and half, guys. Don't worry. What's the pieces? You should have turned them over the other way and brush. Yeah, don't have that's seal. <laughs> then to take out the cheese and make smaller one. But too Man. late. <laughs> Another day we're gonna try that back. The properly. name it all I met you met you now. Why right, this is going in the oven. This cheese was gonna share equally in four pieces. 
Okay, in two pieces. Because the children are going to eat it. Why you didn't put them in the oven? I want you to put them in the oven. Good! No, no, no. I need to move them down. Okay, let's see the um The magic. The macaroni cheese is browning nicely here. Ow! You want me to help Damn you? Something on my hand. Okay. And that's looking in there. Where is the other one going to go? Butter. <laughs> <laughs> Inimini, mini, 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 Um, I have no idea. You guys are not sharing your, your cooking disasters with us. Why would you want to share cooking disasters with I want to hear stories. Everybody, when they cook, they do some stupidness. Everybody on this thing here is probably export chefs and bakers. Is that true, guys? Well, this kitchen is hot. Yes, please. Just grab them out, man, you know, woman. Right, so in another 15 minutes. Oh, that's nice. We will check it to see how it comes out. What are we supposed to do in 15 minutes? I don't know. What am I doing? What am I doing? My WhatsApp just crashed. I feel like you didn't cook a price. Let me make one. <laughs> <laughs> you feel like you think a lot of things, love. I'm done for today. When I'm finished, I'm going to wash my hair and throw back with Netflix. Did you put holes in all of them with the fork? I don't know if I did it to all of them, but <laughs> most of them get holes. Okay, 350 for about 25 minutes. 350 is gas mark, what in the UK? 350 to gas 177 so 180 roughly which is where we're at okay so who's gonna clean up this kitchen now you darling really yes love you know for coming love when you want me to clean up kitchen and the thing huh? So y'all get up an old, old time story now and tell me why you be idle. Help me get some sense. 25 minutes this thing in the bake pot. We can't keep these people now watching us for 25 whole minutes. So it's extra pineapple here. How much do we actually make there? Two for me. <laughs> See the weather outside, very gloomy. Anyway, I think we should just post some the pictures of um, yeah. how they finish. What do you guys think? You want to wait or you want to go? <laughs> we'll share you guys pictures, don't worry. And please tell us 
what you think, what you fancy watching us. You missed the spot. Do next time. Somebody already recommend um, one of my cousin. Yeah. She wants to see how you do rice, dry down. Oh, yeah. Like dried on cooker price. Oh, well, I like dried on cooker price. I don't like dried on cooker price. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is such a lot to say you should make something else while we're waiting. <laughs> it's true, no? What can we make? What can we make? You take them for a walk. Outside, the streets of London. Outside. <laughs> <laughs> Instead of a wait, let's make something else. What else do you have to make for tomorrow? Okay, banana bread. Really? Yeah. You have flour? Ria! <laughs> Ria! Come look yourself. Come. Get a banana stairs and watch Anybody ever make banana bread? <laughs> but like me, I really get energy for the duck. Banana. Speck of banana. Best banana ever. Mash too for me now. Sugar, suffering the flour. Self-raising flour. Is she okay? What do I mash this thing in? A bowl? I don't want to make anything more. It won't take long, I promise. That's my words, you know, against me. The, uh, the people have spoken, we have to listen. I'll tell you what, I'm gonna end this video. Yeah. And then I'm gonna restart it back. Okay. Yeah? I'm gonna end this video and you guys follow me come follow me back straight away. While we tuning in for banana bread. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>